Hi traders, this is the first technical system video of Forex Horn. Sure, we have more videos in following days, and we will explain more Forex systems. At the first screen, you saw a girl holding dollars. She is just a wallpaper, but be sure that this system makes money. Let's start. In this Forex system, I want to share you one of our technical templates, which we are using while giving signals. In this system, there is no additional indicators. Yes, I use only default indicators which are on MT4. In this system, we are getting help from moving average, Fibonacci levels and MICD or MACD indicator. Yes, this is so simple. Now let's put the indicators to the chart and make your own template together. First open your MT4 platform and in the Navigator window, you can see the indicators. If you double click on the indicator list, uh, you can see a list like this. And our indicators are uh, first, as I told you, MICD, uh, like here, MACD. And if you double click on this indicator, you can see the default settings. The default settings are 12, 26, and 9. Also, we use four different moving averages. As you can see here, uh, there is a moving average. We will add four different moving average. The first one is five exponential moving average. You, you must change the settings from exponential in here and uh, make the style, the color yellow. And uh, the value is five. You must add this to the chart. And the second one is 15 simple moving average its color is blue or aqua and the third one is 100 simple moving average the color is red and also the third moving average is 200 simple moving average like here 200 100 15 and 5 and the macd is here as you can see the bars top points and the bars bottom points are below or above the red line and these uh, lines will give us the signals so let's go through the system if the price is so close to 100 or 200 moving average we can say less than 25 pips we don't open any position even other conditions are okay for a trade we don't open any position so the main question is so when we open a position First, we will wait for the current bar closing price. Now, I am using this system in hourly charts, as you can see. And in hourly charts, uh, every hour a bar close and a new bar opens. So, as you can see from here, the price is going up to here and then goes down to here and closes from that price. And the second price opening from there. So we will wait for a bar close and we will see the second bar's opening price. At that time, 5 exponential moving average crosses the 15 moving average. In other words, if the yellow moving average, like here, as you can see it's below, crosses the blue moving average and it's now above the blue line, this will be a signal. And at that time, if the MACD indicator is in the same position, as you can see, this is a sell signal because the top points are below the red line, and this is a buy signal because the, the bottom points are above the red line. At the same point, for example, in here, the yellow line going up crosses the blue one, and it's above the blue line. As you can see, this is a buy signal and the bottom of the moving average is above the red line. This is a buy signal too. So we will open a buy position in here. Let's start from the beginning. As you can see, the yellow line crosses the blue line and going up, this is an uptrend. And uh, we are looking, the top of the bars are going up and crosses the red line. So this is an uptrend too. We will open a buy position from here and wait for two indicators giving a sell signal. 
like here. First one, MACD gives a cell signal from here, but when we look at to the moving carrier, which is the yellow, is still above, so we will not close that position. When the yellow line crosses the blue line, like here, we can close the position and open a cell position. We will sell from here and wait, wait, wait. As you can see, there is a fake moving coverage by signal, but uh, the MACD indicator is still in downtrend, so we will not close the position from here, and we will still wait, 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 wait. And at here, MACD indicator gives a buy signal, so we must close it from there, but uh, at that point, the yellow line, the yellow moving coverage below the blue moving coverage, so we, we will still waiting. And at here, as you can see, it crosses the blue red line, and this moving coverage gives the second buy signal. As you can see, the first buy signal from here, and the second buy signal from here. And so we will open a buy position from here and close the, the order from which we sell from here. We will open a buy position and still waiting, waiting, waiting. And at here, as you can see, the first sell signal comes from MACD. This is a sell signal, but we can see that the yellow line still above the blue line, so we will wait for a cross. Yeah, that point. We get the cross and uh, we will close the buy position and open a new sell signal. You can put the stop or take profit orders in 200 or 100 moving averages. That points are a good take profit places or a stop loss places. Also, you can use Fibonacci retracement levels. As you can see, this is the bottom and this is the top point. We will Fibonacci retracement levels. And uh, this is a good support and we will wait for a Sidious. And we will put our stop below or that retracement level or uh, here or here. Uh, this is your choice, this is your risk. So you will decide where to put your stop loss. Of course, I always use this one or this one. These two are a good stop or take profit levels for me. So I am using these ones. If I get a sell signal from here, I will put my take profit orders to here or to here, or maybe I will put my take profit order to do 100 moving coverage value like here. Yes, the system is like this. I guess I will explain this system clearly. If you have any questions, uh, you can ask it. I'm giving our email address at the bottom, you can find it. If you have any additional questions, please ask us. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.